Hi, my name is Riyaz Sheikh and welcome to my channel, Apis Academy. So today we're gonna derive the formula, derive the formula for area of circle. I hope you know what is the area of circle. That's pi r square. Area of circle is equals to pi r square. So by how, how this magical formula that is pi r square has came up, we'll try to understand it in this video. So let's move on to our whiteboard. So before starting, we have to understand what is circumference. Circumference is nothing but the total length, outermost length of the circle. It's nothing but total length of a circle. That is outermost length of the circle. If the circle rotates one complete rotation, it's complete one rotation. So it covers a one circumference. Simple as that. So formula for the circumference is 2 pi r or pi b. Actually, this is how the pi ka value we come out. That is ratio of circumference to the derivative. That is a concept for some another video. But right now, circumference that is the perimeter of the circle is equal to 2 pi r or pi b. So remember, that is a very important formula that the outermost layer of the circle, the length of the outermost layer of the circle is 2 pi r. So let's move on to the next actual topic that is the area. For the area, we consider one circle that is with the radius r. So we will divide the circle into co-centric uh, layers or a co-centric rings or circle, whatever you would like to say. All are has the same center of a same length of a, the circle which you have assumed. That is nothing but the co-centric circles. So we will cut the ring, right? We will cut all the rings from the same length. So we will cut and expand it to a single straight line. So the length of that line will be 2 pi r. How? Because it's the same outermost ring of the same circle. We are just cutting it and making it a straight line. So it was a circle and we had made it a straight line. So it's equals to nothing but 2 pi r. So we'll be doing same for the other circles as well. The inner circle 2 that will become, that, that will be in a smaller length. Of course, it is a smaller circle. If you have observed it, the outermost line and the inner line is shorter. That is, there is a difference between those lines. It is simple because the length of the outer circle will be more than the length of the inner circle. So that's the reason there is a difference in the line. So we do same for the inner circle and then for the inner circle and for the inner circle and so on. You can see there is some kind of shape which is being formed. If we can predict it. Yes, yes, yes. It's, it is nothing but a triangle. It's nothing but a triangle. So we did nothing, but we take taken a square, made, uh, sorry, taken a circle, then we cut it into small rings. That rings, the outermost ring has been converted to do a small straight line. Then inner ring a straight line, then inner ring a straight line. That will be infinite number of those rings. And we are cutting it, making a straight line. It making nothing but a triangle. So triangle ka, we got it, the outermost length was nothing but the length of the triangle. So, okay, what is the base then? The base is nothing but the radius of the circle. How? If you observed it clearly, we cut this uh, <clears throat> outer ring and put it over here. So this, the small part of, part of that, this value has become over here. Then the inner, that is here then the inner ring which is here, then the inner ring which is here and so on that is nothing but we cut all the rings and we make that base which is radius of the circle. So from this uh, small um, matter we realize that the area of the circle is nothing but the equals to the area of this triangle. Area of circle is equals to area of triangle. So we need to find area of circle so area of a triangle is half into base into height. That's a classical formula for the area of triangle that is half into base into height. So in this case, we know the base is r and the height is 2 pi r. We'll substitute it in formula, then 2, 2 will get cancelled. r into r will become r square. And this is how we will get the area of circle, which is pi r square. Got it? Right? It's simple as that. It's just like looking at the sums or else looking at the shape a bit differently. We have convert, converted the circle to triangle. So this is what Max is looking at things differently. 
so that's all for the video if you find it insightful do share it with your friends and drop a like so that it can reach out to more people and if you have any other topic that you believe that i should cover it or else you want me to cover it i would love to hear that do, do comment down below till then see you soon in our next video take care take care of yourself and the people around you bye